helps humanities getting stronger and its fight in return. She recruits the professor to help develop a plan to defeat the gods. On the other side of town, Lizzie and Aurora tries to bribe Jen to get her to tell them about the gods. The first step in defeating the gods is recruiting candidates. Braid and the professor makes cards with everyone's abilities to test their strengths. Caleb's in disbelief when he learns that MG's actually faster. Ted's still trying to figure out a way to escape Limbo, but Landon's not on board with his plan. Jen tells Aurora and Lizzie her story of the gods and how she was cast out and how she was able to trap them forever, unable to awaken without a key. Back at the Salvatore school, on their first trial, Hope and Alike argues whether or not Lizzie will switch sides during the battle. Landon and the Necromancer makes a stand for lost souls. They learn that there's a bandit that's been stealing coins, and Ted looks to lure them. After many failed trials that all ended with someone dying, Hope still refuses to listen to her humanity. Jen tells Lizzie and Aurora that she hid the key inside Ben. However, they failed to mention that he was still alive, and they ran off to find him. The Super Squad has had enough of Hope, willing to put them in danger, and they decide to end the trial. Lizzie and Aurora arrive at the school, where Lizzie sees her dad for the first time after his incident. Aurora tells Lizzie it's okay to return. And Lizzie tells her if she decides to go through with her plan, the school will be forced to come after her. Then I would consider that a betrayal. Hope finally decides to listen to her humanity and was successful in the last trial. However, she loses control and a lag snaps her neck. What are you all doing? Don't you see I'm about to kill you all? Someone take me out! MG and Ethan promises to keep Lizzie safe no matter what the outcome. Landon decides to help Ted with his plan and they both get kidnapped. Dad and Ben shares a moment when Aurora and Lizzie arrives and captures Ben. The episode ends with Alaric talking to someone who could be one of the Michelsons who will try to save Hope.